We take you on a journey to the mysterious Cutlass Forest in the year 1959. Legend has it that a mysterious man has inhabited this forest since the 17th century. Who is this man? It's believed to be the famous pirate Nobeard. Tourists come from all over the world to this Floridian coastline forest to see if they could catch themselves a glimpse of the famed Nobeard. Jack and Joe's mini adventures. 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 Hey everyone, and I'm glad you could make it to the third episode of Jack and Joe. Today, we're in the Cutlass Forest and hopes to find the infamous No Beard. No, we won't! I hate No Beard, and I hate this show! Uh, okay then, I guess this would be a good time to introduce our guide and interpreter, Carlos. Aloha. Hi, my name's Carlos. Um, these idiots, they uh, saw me mowing my lawn a while ago and assumed I was Hispanic, and I don't think they realize all Floridians aren't Hispanic. So they offered me a grant to be their guide and interpreter for a couple of days, and uh, so I took it up. But anyways, my real name is Ron Wilson, and uh, yeah, keep it hush hush. This is it? Si, senor. Wow. Joe needs to see this. Where is he today? I get him. I get Go them. find him. It's my birthday, and Jack forgot it was my birthday! Hey! What are you doing? This is my no, shot! What, what are, are you doing, doing in my God, shot? No, stop! Do you know what happened last time? Someone forgot it was my birthday? Dude, dude, no. Oh, Jack, he need. He of needs. course he needs. He can't do anything. He can't do anything. I can't even. There you are. Oh, what's gotten into you today? I thought pirates were your favorite thing besides whales. Well, they are, Jack. But there's other things that are important to me too. Like what? Like, I don't know. Maybe me copianos? What? Uh, what, is, what does he mean? Tigris. Tigris. Tigers? Joe, you know you'd piss yourself if you saw a tiger. Holy sh. Dios mio. This must be no beer tied up. We found it. Oh, dang it! I take it back. Give me your hand. No, you can't do that. Yes, I can! And I take my friendship with me! Joe, we're on television for goodness sake. Let's just go check out the fort. I can't believe these morons found it. Nobody's been able to find this thing for years. Yes. Maybe they're geniuses. Do it! <gasps> Guys, look! An old gun! That has to be no beards. We must be really close. Oh, Carlos, you picked up our language well. Oh, guys, no beer standing right in front of us. This is amazing. I can't believe it. Amazing, eh? Will it be amazing when I rip your throat out and shove it up your ear in place of your digestive system? That's kind of violent. Oh, I'm not fast, senor. Get out of here alive and spill me secret heart out. Please, sir, we won't talk. Carlos doesn't even speak English. No, I stupid. Uh, in, no. Here, take Joe. Hey, hey. No, what? <laughs> Come here. Hey, Jack, mind. I'll kill you. Not your friend no, anymore. No, no. Do you fear death? Joe. Do you fear that this will be the last face that you see? The last breath that you smell? Stop. Prepare yourself. Stop. But Davy chose his locker! This is the worst day of my life! Are you scared? Yes! I have one last thing to say to you. Do you know what it is? Oh, uh, happy birthday, Joe! Jack, you set all this up for me? Yeah, 
I would never forget your birthday. I was just getting kind of freaked out because uh, the no beard act or was getting kind of freaky. <laughs> <laughs> Check! Oh my goodness, I love you! <laughs> Ron Wilson, out. <laughs> Should have put up a fence to keep him from jumping, right? <laughs> All right, give me your wallets. <laughs>